welcome back to Beneath the Long Man's Feet. Here we are on the 31st of October, Samhain, Halloween, and I couldn't let this day pass without marking it in some small way, could I? So here is a short poem to mark the turn. It's called Remember, hope you like it. Whether they are buried in ground where an ancient stone now stands, or whether they are buried in forgotten graves in far off lands, or whether they are buried in tombs in the valley or long barrows high upon the hill. The old ones, the ancestors, we know they are with us still. And at this time of the year as the wheel turns and the nights are drawing in, the veil between their world and ours, it grows thin. Summer's end, winter's begun, a final harvest at Samhain. We invite the ancestors and ask for their guidance again. To divine the future, cards are drawn and the runes are cast. But before we find the answer, we must look to the past. Before a new chapter is written, before the page is turned, we must look to the ancestors and see what lessons can be learned. But at Sawain, it's not just for guidance that we call. We call to remember all those who have gone before. We call their names so they know that in our minds and our hearts they are never ever forgotten and we invite them now as the veil it parts. We call to remember them. We who are the ancestors of a future age just as we hope to be remembered by our children before they turn their final page. Sour blessings to you all my friends. Halloween fun if that's what you do. However you mark the turn, all souls day, whatever it is to you, I hope it's a good one. Uh, do drop me a line on Beneath the Long Man's Feet. Let me know how you celebrate or what you thought of this short poem. Um, Facebook or YouTube, whichever is your preferred medium. But of course, until we meet again, as always, I bid you hail and farewell.